Valley has seen its first two animals test positive for West Nile this year. This is the first sign the virus is in the valley this year. KMIR 6's Matt Vanderveer joins us in Palm Desert with the details. Matt. Well, it's humid days like today that make mosquito bites all too prevalent. And now that West Nile is officially in the desert, it's important people are taking all precautions to stay safe. This could be your hand if you're not careful. La Quinta resident Leonel McCann says in the right condition, this can be deadly. Especially out here where the sun is so strong and the water heats up so fast and you get all these different bacteria growing. We do know that there are mosquitoes who have West Nile virus in that area because the sentinel chickens have tested positive. The Coachella Valley Mosquito and Vector Control District has 10 coops across the valley housing seven chickens that are tested every week. This week, two chickens tested positive for West Nile. What they call a dead end host. So even though the mosquitoes will bite the chickens and the chickens will make antibodies to the virus, but they won't actually become infectious to where they can pass it on to other mosquitoes. The chickens that tested positive come from Mecca near the Salton Sea. But around the edges of the Salton Sea where there's lots of vegetation and the water doesn't move, it's a perfect place for mosquitoes to breed. Now this year we haven't seen as many cases of West Nile. Last year there were four chickens that tested positive. This year only two. Last year 22 mosquitoes tested positive for West Nile. This year zero. Once a bird gets the virus and becomes infected and, they're and they develop antibodies to that virus, then they're immune to that virus for the rest of their life. And so it may take a few years to get new birds that are naive to that virus or haven't been exposed. So to avoid an armful of this, you may need to sacrifice a little comfort. Not very pleasant in the heat right now, but uh, wearing long sleeves, or if you don't want to wear long sleeves or long pants, then to wear a mosquito repellent. Which McCann says is worth it. It's definitely important um, because it can cause illness and death. Now, for more safety tips, you can go to our website, that's KMIR6.com, and click on this story. In Palm Desert, Matt Vanderveer, back to you.